my first time in Vancouver and it's so beautiful. It has a really relaxed energy. It's a lot different than New York. <laughs> What's your name? I'm Lucy. I am Lucy Hale, and I'm probably most recognizable from a show called Pretty Little Liars. I am in Vancouver filming my new CW series called Life Sentence, which is very exciting. You have no idea how excited I am for this. Oh, I'm so glad. It's had a lot kind of popping in, so. My heart is beating really fast. Oh, so. no worries. I don't recognize you, but I probably recognize like what you've done. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Uh, Pretty Little Liars. Oh, okay, of course. Yes. Awesome. It's humbling. We need to hear that every now and then. Oh my then, gosh. Right? Yeah. Well, the only th I but it's actually probably better. Yeah. Oh, I prefer because I don't get super nervous then. Have you had someone that you've gotten really nervous for? Oh my god, yes. There's been, oh. Well, RuPaul was a good example. That oh, was like, I like okay. almost fainted. I, I, would, like, I would freak out I over like, RuPaul. I was losing it. I've been looking forward to this so much. You have no idea. This is my first time doing anything remotely like this. But I'm a very open-minded person. Talk to me about aliens or whatever, and I'm like, sure, of course they're out there. And I definitely believe in an afterlife. I always say that you know whoever comes through, I believe is meant to come through. So it could be someone we're close with, it could be someone that is like a distant family member or not even a family member at all. Mm -hmm. um, another way that I work sometimes is a hold onto objects. So do you happen yes. to have any today? I do. Awesome, so if you want to put them out on the table. So we have one, we look have one, up. you know. That keeps it easy. <laughs> One thing that I'm hoping for is to just communicate with someone who is very, very important to me. This person was just like everything to me. And I'm in a place in my career where it's kind of, it's very exciting, it's a new chapter, so it would be nice to know they're aware of my success and to be able to have some sort of communication would be, you know, I, I would be set. So I have like a lot popping in. I'm gonna take one minute just to try to okay. process it all. So. Go there, there. I'm a mom. Bring it home to the family. Okay, I'm gonna go there. It's amazing to see him processing everything and see him doodling and like almost like you can see the information coming in. I love your face. Uh, thank you. I know it's all I'm a mess. It's pretty fascinating. I'm just gonna get this all out. Might not even be related to the object, but I just have to bring this person cool. through because it's coming in. I keep hearing your name over and over again. My name? <laughs> your name. Yeah. Over and over and over and over Aww. again. It's funny. Um, so clearly it's somebody who wants to connect, but they are having me talk about casino. What is that? Casino. Check and see who would have gone to like a casino. <laughs> this is like a funny thing. Or like would have done the blackjack or the poker or whatever this is. Yeah. Because it's like a whole thing, but it's like coming across in a funny way. So okay. um, it's sentimental, but it's like our get together at a place where we would play poker or play blackjack or play card games. Wait. You, you see cards? Mm -hmm. Cards, literally like cards. Oh, the, the thing me and this person would do, we would do solitaire on her computer. Oh, okay. And she taught me how to play solitaire. That's funny, because every time I do it, I, I think of right. I, That's so sweet, yeah. Oh, wow. That's cute. This is odd, gift, 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 gift. I don't know why I keep seeing this. There's actually two of these. So this is the weirdest thing. They're showing me two rings, not just one. And I don't know why. I'm holding on to it, but I'm saying two, 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 two. No idea why. Um... I do. That ring originally belonged to my grandmother. Uh, her name was Karen, uh, which is actually my first name. I'm named after her, but I've always gone by Lucy. And she was my um, grandmother on my dad's side. She always told me growing up, when I pass away, this is going to be a ring. And then you, you kept bringing up two rings. Right. So she would always wear, you know, one on one hand and one on the other. And she'd be like, to my sister, this will be yours and this will be yours. And I was always like kind of mad because my sister got the bigger one. Uh -huh. But this is still gorgeous. So my grandmother, yeah, we were super close. She was a very important figure in my childhood because I spent a lot of time with her. That desire to want to be with her or the feeling of missing them never goes away. I mean, there are moments when I'll, I'll still cry about her. It's actually funny because she had a personality <laughs> that deserved to be like famous in <laughs> the way this comes across yeah. for how they were. Yeah. Like in a crowd of people, <laughs> they're, they're like the oh, one person. She was the life on. of the party. Where I come from, it's like there's like a certain way of thinking, and she was always a little left of center. And I feel, I feel like I definitely 
would go to her for advice and like she made me watch Oprah growing up to learn not to do things and right. um, she taught me to be really open-minded so yeah. <laughs> a gift. I think that having someone that exposes that to us and yeah. allows us to at such a formative time in right. our life is one of the greatest gifts. That's yeah. so special. She thought differently, she acted differently, she dressed differently. It was cute because he kept giggling and I knew it was because he could feel how quirky she was. <laughs> I'm seeing my symbol for show, like a show. Okay, I'm show you. I'm seeing a woman, like literally, like doing this. I don't know what this is all about, but it's like, I don't know. I, I do. Okay, interesting. Wow. What does that mean? I have a photograph framed of my grandmother with friends and they're all doing that. That's just her way of validating. Wow. She's with you. That's my favorite photo. I, th I want to say she's in her cheerleading right. uniform with her cheerleading friends. Are, yeah, but it's it's the greatest photo of all time. Right. It's hilarious. It was wow. so random because I was seeing it. I was like, I don't know how to word this. I'm just going to have to show you. It's going to dance for me. Yeah. <laughs> that blew my mind because I have the photo in my house, I got it framed. I definitely felt like I was with her today. But then again, I, I always feel close to her. So that's why it was even cooler to come here and for him to put it into words because I definitely always feel her presence. It's wild. And this person is also having me bring forward um, your success. This is sweet. Oh. It's always some for a trophy, which is always like success. It's funny, yeah. she's showing me the little, um, like I'm saying like, uh, what is this? I'm saying puppets, in other words, like, Are I you serious? swear to God, There's... and it's, it's, what is this? There, <laughs> so my grandmother had this chest in her house and right. with a bunch of toys. It was like a, like a cloth, like, I don't know if it was a duck or a pig, but I would always play with it. She's bringing me to that time in your life and she already mm -hmm. felt like you were gonna be something special even back then. There's something even about you at that younger age that she was yeah, able to I, identify as being. I think she, I was, yeah, yeah. You know, she she kind of believed in you even maybe before you believed no, in yourself. she, she yeah. definitely did, yeah. yeah. And like me and my sister talk about it all the time, like we wish she could be here to see what I've done. And Absolutely. I don't think many people thought in my family that it would be what it is, but, but I, I always think that she did. Are there any questions about career that you might have, or health, or family, or anything? We could go any direction. I, I mean, career-wise, yeah. Yes. Bring it on. Do. Great. Let's look. There. Thank you. Travel. Ooh, that's a whole thing. Okay. So, deal is, is that I'm bring up 2018. That I'm talk about travel, but it's like going to be to multiple places. Is it for work? It's separate. Yeah. Um, it's also not vacation, but it's separate in the way this is coming across. I, I That's feel... so crazy. That makes a lot of sense to me because I just had a friend who traveled and did a, like, a lot of charity work, like nice. he bopped over everywhere. And I was like, that sounds that like something sense. that I, I definitely want to do. And so we were actually just talking about it the other day. So they're really putting a very strong emphasis on like this travel aspect. It feels good. Now I know I'm going to do it. <laughs> it's exciting. All right. I'm so excited. What about. What about my love life? Oh Lord, everybody asks that Tell one. Tell me. Oh yes, well, let's look on that. Front. You're like, I'm getting nothing. I'm like, <laughs> great. Mom. Um, you know, for some reason, they're emphasizing more of a focus on like relationships, love life, that kind of thing, outside of Canada. Like United States, for some reason. Okay. Um, doesn't mean that we can't have great experiences here. Well, that kind of, okay. It's Actually, mm, okay. <sighs> the way this comes through is like, no, it's not here. <laughs> Don't. Yeah. Um, that, that's a great reminder that I needed. Yes. So, okay. <laughs> How do I word? He said that there's a, a situation now and just to let that be and to, and it, it, that actually is something I need to hear. It was a door that needs to be closed and that was a little cherry on top and I'm going to close it and it's done. <sighs> you and me both. Yes. It's a lot. It's yeah. a lot of, lot to process. This was Fascinating. You're incredible. I'm so glad. You're such a light. You're oh. such a like, uh, I just want to be around you all the time. <laughs> oh, well, seriously, I'll give you my number. Oh, great. We're going to hang out. So, exactly. see you guys later. We're going to go. Yeah, exactly. See you guys. I came into this a believer. I'm leaving even bigger of a believer. There, there are details and things that he said that there's no way he could have found out. I guess I came in expecting to hear about like super on the surface stuff, but he, there, he dug in deep. Can I keep your scribble artwork? Of course, absolutely. You got two pages worth. You better believe I'm gonna frame this and put it in my All house. Right. 
That was like top three coolest experiences of my life. I don't know, maybe this is top two. Yeah, skydiving and meeting with Tyler. <laughs> I love it here. Oh, this is beautiful. Genuinely I could see myself it. living here. Right? I think we often get caught up in things that aren't important at all and you don't realize that there's so much else going on in the world. I haven't seen stars living in LA in like right. 15 years. Oh my so. gosh, it's the yeah. place to do it. I do feel hopeful and grateful and like content. It's, it's a good feeling. Awesome, yay. <laughs> And I'm gonna put Tyler in my little pocket because he's so cute.